that when you're an entrepreneur, personal brand plays an important role in attracting new business. So how do you ensure that your brand is widely recognized and accepted? Timothy Maurice Webster, a personal branding expert, author as well as a columnist, is hosting a series of talks during the Global Entrepreneurship Week. Timothy is now in studio to inform us on the art of branding. So good yes, to have you. Welcome to Morning to see you. Live. Thank you very much for having it. I love talking to you about branding. We always <laughs> chat about branding. It's, yes. your, it's your, 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 basically your strong point in life. How do you yes. excel in branding yourself well? Well, essentially a brand is an ambassador for your values. And it's about authenticity and congruency. I always, I mean, one of the things that I love about branding, it's like we are wired to associate your image with your essence. So if you see a lion and it starts barking, you get really uncomfortable, right? Yeah. Because at the end of the day, you've been told that the lion is supposed to roar. <laughs> yeah. So that yeah. authenticity between the look of the lion and what you expect from it is where the true brand and power is. And I think that's one of the big things we've been talking about in Global Entrepreneurship Week is that you need to be reliable as an entrepreneur. What can I expect from you? Can I expect you to be innovative and efficient? Or are you barking today and roaring the next day? Yeah. And that's one of the big keys is that authenticity and congruency, which I talk about in my recent book, Soul to Soul. All right. So, you know, I can imagine that things have changed so much with the advent of social media. Yes. Uh, branding yourself on social media can be a good thing and it can also be a bad sure, thing. I sure. mean, that, that, that is the reality. Yeah. Talk to us about these influences. Yeah. So social media is one of the most beautiful and powerful weapons in the world. I mean, the big thing about social media, it gives you the opportunity to observe people on a consistent basis. And when doing so, you can extract powerful things about people um, from, from what we call the neutral point of view. So you may be tweeting today about something as silly as, um, you know, what, what you messed up, messing up a food uh, or a dish. Yeah. And tomorrow you may be tweeting about some incredible news thing. But over time, what we call the NPV, the neutral point of view, arises out of it. So I suggest to people that, you know, you don't overthink it. You just sort of be yourself and enjoy the space, but have an ultimate goal in mind because that neutral point of view will come out. Yeah, it will do. I mean, you look at this, you look at this furore at the moment of, uh, I can't even think of her name. I've seen it so many times. The, uh, is, it, is her name Melissa Buchan? I'm not too sure. Melissa. Oh, yeah. The lady with who? Shot the lion. That's yeah. the one. I mean, now that, in terms of how she has ruined herself on social media just I don't even she's want to talk finished. about the issue yeah. Yeah, 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 of what yeah. she's sure, done sure, because sure. it infuriates me sure. but you know that I mean her brand is dead yeah it, it is it's or is it yeah, well I, I think that she's gonna receive a lot of backlash probably the only thing that's gonna save her is the fact that you know it wasn't illegal yeah. you know it just looks horrible yeah. but it wasn't it wasn't illegal and I think there's you know it's, it you know, it's always that juxtaposition between you know what seems right on social media and what is actually Allowed. And, yeah, you know. that's insane. And, and publishing it everywhere from Facebook yeah, to exactly. Twitter to Instagram, exactly. you name it. Anyway, let, let's talk about um, uh, Entrepreneurship Week, Global Entrepreneurship yes. Week. You're going to be delivering a series of talks. Yes. Um, how? I mean, obviously, sure. entrepreneurship and brand, yes. that is, uh, they yeah. go hand in hand. But how well, does it work? Yeah, this Global Entrepreneurship Week is a powerful thing. You know, in 2007, when they started this, 33 countries are already involved. A year later, 77 countries are involved. And in South Africa, Endeavor Leadership 2020, who I'm representing with my good brother DJ Spoo, Nicholas Regisford. Those guys are doing incredible work. So I'm just one small member of the team. And what we are talking about is that leading into 2020, we need to have a goal and a direct vision about how entrepreneurship can impact the role of creating jobs and, you know, really sort of getting people involved in terms of raising awareness around consciousness about. Uh, the role entrepreneurs can play in taking this country forward. And my little small role is really to say to the entrepreneur that you really need to take full ownership of your personal identity as it relates to your entrepreneurship initiative. Yeah. So it, you know, the bottom line, if you look at yourself, your personal brand adds value to this platform on TV, so SABC. Mine is you, it becomes a different platform. Are you mm -hmm. with me? Mm -hmm. So at the end of the day, the personal brand can offer enormous value to the entrepreneurship initiative. So bringing a relationship and talking about that, uh, it, you know, along with the you know, Branson School of Entrepreneurship, this is a very important conversation. Yeah. Just finally, before I let you go, some details, where, when, how, how do we get details? Yeah, so from the 18th through the 24th, uh, you know, go to, go, to the, go to the site, go to check Google Global Entrepreneurship Week, GEW, okay. 
and just check out South Africa's, because like I said, 77 countries involved. Just check it out. You'll be able to see that there are in incredible initiatives happening. And check out leadership2020.co.za and look at the work we're doing there as well. Okay, leadership2020.co.za. Yes. Otherwise, uh, Google uh, Global Entrepreneurship Week, but have a look at the South African uh, sector to find out exactly what's happening. Absolutely. It's always nice having Thank you. Thank you. Thanks Welcome for having and me. thank you so much Cheers. for being our guest here on Morning Live. All right.